Good morning. I'm here to show you a box for a two to four year old boy. Um, this box is in a blue theme. Uh, it is teensy bit larger. It's a men's size 12, but not as big as a boot box. It's a seven quart. So not too much bigger than the standard six quart size. All right, so let's open this up. The top is a calendar picture that I've put down with strapping tape. Oh, I just realized I forgot to write inside the lid. I'll write inside the lid later. Okay, so here's what he sees when he opens it up. Blue. Um, this is a blanket. And I don't know if I can show you how big this is on this video because... It's slightly larger than the card table that I'm filming on. Um, I'm not sure what this material is called. I asked the lady that gave it to me, and she couldn't remember either. Um, but I do remember my baby blanket when I was a kid. My security blanket. One of the sides, it was double sided. One of the sides was made of this same material. So it's really nice and soft. It's not terribly thick, but it that's probably good to fit it in a shoebox, right? So, he's got a nice big blanket. All right. Then he has an outfit. He has a pair of cargo pants. These were from Kohl's. Um, clearance. They were like a dollar. Uh, online. Every once in a while you look out with their online clearance. And then he has a Mickey Mouse shirt. Long sleeve to go with that. The shirt's from Walmart. And then in the clothes department, he's also got some underwear. There's two pair of underwear, a size two, three, and a size four, five, because I don't know how big he'll be. A couple pairs of socks for the loom socks. So there's one pair that's blue. This pair is gray. Alright, and then I guess sort of in the clothing department, he also has a pair of mittens. Or gloves, I guess. They got fingers, right? That makes them gloves. <laughs> okay, also in blue, we've got his bunny friend here. So bunny friend. And then a uh, blue ball. These are the five inch... NFL knobbly balls from RaymondGettys.com. So they're nice and easy to catch. They're advertised as five inches, I think, but most of them are more like four. So they're the right height to get in a box. Um, they come deflated. I blow them up before I send them. And then he also has a little stress ball with a bug on it. Blue. Let's see what else we got in here. Some sidewalk chalk. A blue cup, and in his cup he's got a comb and a toothbrush and a set of IKEA utensils. So there. He has soap and a washcloth. I didn't have any blue washcloths, so something's not blue. And then we have a little bag, which I made to hold the toys. And put trains on the top because he has a Thomas the Tank Engine set in here. So here are the tracks for the Thomas set. And the windmill that came with it. These were Walgreens after Christmas clearance. Um, since Walgreens doesn't carry many toys year round, they have awesome clearance right after Christmas. So I've managed to get some really nice Hot Wheels and um, like cars with play mats and, and these this year um, that way for a little more than a dollar. So definitely worth it if you're shopping next year. He has a blue truck. 
and a wooden car that Mr. Smith at church made for me. He made me a couple dozen of them. He'll probably make me some more later. He loves making these. Um, where's Thomas? Oh, there's Thomas. Thomas Tank Engine was hiding. Hi, Thomas. And also in here, in his train bag, he has a mustache lip whistle and some Paw Patrol stickers. Those are Valentine's. He has flashcards. These were uh, Walmart after Easter. It's actually in a box. Let me grab one and show you. Here it is. The box looks like this, but inside there's four of these. So you get a uh, alphabet, colors and shapes, numbers, and sight words. So, and they're on clearance right now because it's 90% off. It was 69 cents, and that's for four sets. So definitely worth it if you're looking for those. They weren't marked. And I've got a school supply pouch. And it, we've got a lenticular valentine, a bunch of pencils, both regular, and some Easter, some valentines, crayons, eraser, blunt tip scissors. And then in the bottom, of course, I have all the flat things. You've seen my videos, you know about flat things, so I've got a board book. It's not blue, but oh well. And then a Paw Patrol coloring pad. A, I believe this is the Wild Friends coloring activity pad. These are in three for one packs at Dollar Tree. The Paw Patrol was from a Christmas Stocking Stuffers multi-pack of six. Sticker from Valentine's, more stickers that I've mined out of Valentine's, picture of myself, which I wrote a little bit on the back, and then a note for myself with uh, my contact information, and on the back as God loves you in, I forget how many different languages. So that's there, and then some plain paper to draw on. I'm out of spiral notebooks, or I would have put a spiral in here. Um, all I have right now is composition. I prefer those for the older kids, so I gave him paper anyway for his artwork. So there we go. That's what I have here for this little fella, age two to four. So if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them below. Thank you for watching.